Alright, what's up everybody? What's going on? Uh, my first vlog on Big Key Favorite, your favorite MC uh, page. Uh, I'm doing a log. I'm doing a vlog for the first time. Y'all, uh, this will be my first time doing it. I'm just decided to do this YouTube channel. Um, it's going to be more on the exotic side of the game. Um, I'm going to be doing stuff like once I'm at home, what I'm doing, getting ready for shows, at the shows. I'll probably be doing interviews at the shows. Uh, like right now, we for the ride out. We for to go see the venue. Uh, we for go to check the venue out, all that good stuff. So uh, like I say, uh, we doing this, we doing this, we doing this. My fi first YouTube channel, uh, tell people to subscribe, go subscribe, go subscribe, go subscribe. What I'm talking about is um, the Zodic Man the Zodic Entertainment World. Male, female, studs. I mean, I'm a, I don't want to say studs. I want to say uh, films. That's what they call them, doms. All that will be on my page. Uh, we'll be talking about the game. We'll be talking to the old school vets. We'll be talking to the new school vets. Uh, at shows, I'll be doing interviews. Um, everything, you'll keep up with shows on here. All that good stuff, all that good stuff. Right here on my page, Big Keith. Your favorite MC page right here. Uh, tell people to subscribe. Tell people to hit us up. Tell people that we ready. We're going to be uh, doing it real big. Uh, this is going down. Um, let me give you a little introduction back myself. Uh, I've been in the game over 25 years right now. 25 years in the game. 25 years in the game. Um, I was born and raised in Chicago. I started in Chicago doing this game 1991. 1991, 1991, 1991. No, it wasn't 1991. It was actually 1995. So, Tell Jacob. Yeah. That's fine. 1995. That was my son, y'all. Uh, joining in. I'm probably gonna cut that out. No, I'm gonna keep mine real. I ain't gonna be cutting stuff out. This is my family. This is what we do. Um, 1991, once I was 18, I was still in it, but not in it all the way. But 1994, um, we started doing Thursday nights with the Man of Leisure at uh, Mr. Leisure Chateau on Madison Street. I was born and raised in Chicago, like I said. Um, we've been, we started there. Um, at first, was I was big in a teen circuit. Um, I had a dance group, all that good stuff. And uh, my brother, Randy, came to me. He said, man, we're going to start. We're going to start doing these men shows, these lockdowns on Thursday nights. It's going to be a party, and uh, we're going to have male entertainment. I said, all right, whatever, you know. I ain't know nothing about it. My sister used to talk about it, but I ain't know nothing about it. Hadn't heard nothing about it, so it was different for me, new for me, so I didn't know what was going on with it. So we used to have, uh, we used to have, I can't think of the MC name. I think it was Dr. Love, Mr. Love, something like that. They used to come through on Thursday nights and host and what I used to do was set up the lineup, run the lineups for them. Uh, we used to set up the lineup and roll the lineups for the guys um, and all that stuff. And we did that on Thursday nights about for about two, three years. Then uh, Saturday night started rolling and all this good stuff. And, um, we was rolling over there on the west side. Then we found out about this place. I had never heard about it. It was the Taste on 63rd and Low. Over on 63rd and Low, 63rd and Low. 63rd and Low is where we are. Uh, well, we started, we started doing bigger bigger venues. Um, it was called Mail Lockdowns. And um, we will have, that was all it was gonna be. It wasn't gonna be no party. It wasn't gonna be nothing like that. They was just gonna come in. Uh, we gonna bring the ladies in. It wasn't like we locking the doors down, but it was a male lockdown where we just brought ladies in. We brought ladies in, we brought ladies in. And I mean, whew, back in them days, we used to have numbers of 400 to 500 ladies, 400 to 500 ladies doing it. Um, and we started doing those once a month, once every other month. And um, it grew bigger and bigger and bigger. I remember we used to have our touchables. I'm giving you history of the entertainment game that I've been part of in Chicago. Uh, big ups to the touchables. Uh, my man Destiny's, Chocolate Shake, Bodacious, Zorro. Um, uh, those really was the main ones back in those days that did it. And man, they used to... We didn't have walkouts then. They used to just come out. Man, they'll walk to the stage. That little juke music come on. They'll juke and do all that. 
man, they used to tear it up. The club used to go crazy. They might have the intro song where they'd walk out on and they just clap their hands like this. Boom, boom, boom. But then they went on and uh, they had, we had called juke music. Back then it was called beat music. It was called beat music. And uh, it was the ghetto house tracks. And we used to, uh, they used to dance to that. And they used to, the club were going crazy every time they danced that. And then, then they had their slow songs and their slow songs, they would uh, have a line of folks. And big ups to my man, may he rest in peace, Mr. Tornado. Mr. Tornado was our host. And uh, man, y'all, I mean, a lot of people say I'm one of the best hosts they've ever seen, but man, ain't nobody better than Tornado. There's nobody better than Tornado, man. I learned a lot from that man, um, how to uh, host. But um, we did that. Uh, we was moving all around um, New Chicago. We'll come to the West Side. We'll go to the Rose. We'll go to the 504 Center. I'm giving you real history right now. Well, we did shows where we have over uh, 500, 600 ladies at the shows. And it would just be crazy. But it was good times. The ladies would come, just be there, uh, having a good time, talking to each other. They was there with the girls. There was no drama, none of that. And like I said, this page will be drama free also. But um, we did all that stuff and we had a good time. Then we moved on to, uh, I see around, I want to say 2000, around 2000, we started doing this show called The Big Show. And the first time we big the show, Big Show, it was, uh, we brought male entertainers from out of town. <coughs> big ups to my man. The ever first two people we ever brought that we brought that I knew about. And they used to have the Black Chippendales come in. Uh, and that was Luscious and all them from ATL. But the first ones that Mel and Ninja ever brought in was uh, Young Rider. Young Rider from New Jersey. And uh, Body from um, Baltimore. And once they came, it was crazy because I remember our ladies was like, what is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? And they really didn't buy into it because at that point it was a transition in the game. It was a big transition in the game. We had a transition in the game where we had um well we had um Honey Love and them were coming out and Bodacious and Chocolate Shape and them were kind of getting they were they was getting to that transition where they were old in the game and they had been around the game for a minute. So we had a transition where Honey Love, Mr. Get It Wet, um, who else was doing that time? Honey Love, Get It Wet was the real big guys at that point in time. They were really taking over the scenes, do damage and all them. They were really taking over the scenes at that point. And it was uh, Shali and them all, they were all young. But Honey Love and Get It Wet was the two that was really taking it would come correct. And I can't remember what Get It Wet was. But um, those was the guys in uh, in Man of Legion. We were doing shows, you know. And we were bringing, we started, man, the leisure started bringing the out-of-towners in the building. And we kept doing it, we kept doing it. Because at first, I was like, man, they not vibing to this. They not vibing to this. They not vibing to this. But um, I always remember, here come the wife, y'all, but I'm going to keep going. Um, I always remember that once we did, uh, once we brought Young Rider the first time, he came out there on them platforms. Everybody's looking at him crazy. And he did his walkout and all that good stuff. No, okay, I'm doing my first vlog too, so you'll be part of it. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't put me on here. Why not? Say hi to the people. Mm, no, sir. Say, come on, say hi to the Negative. people. Hello. Say hey. Say hey to everybody. I'm gone. Yeah, you'll be seeing her in it a lot too. Um, but I'm giving the history right now. Um, so history of what? Oh, the game, where I came from, and how we, mm. how we started, and uh, I'm at the point once we first I brought Young Rider. And uh, them, and I, I remember once the our Chicago ladies like, what is this? We ain't never seen no man, no platforms, none of this stuff. But the man came out, and I mean, it was like different. We didn't know what it was. We didn't know what a walkout was and all that. So we stuck with it. We stuck with it. We stuck with it. But then we kind of moved on, and we did something different. We kept moving. We kept moving, and we brought him back. And this time, man, he did a song. Um, that Dion work that had Luther on it, that Luther song. Um, and man, once he did that song, that man set it on fire. And it was just one song. It wasn't nothing else. The song was just one song. He didn't do nothing else on it. That's all he did. And um, he tore the place down and that opened the floodgates. 
that opened the floodgates. That's when we started bringing Assassin, Baby Boy, um, Tim, um, Black Dragon, Luscious. We was bringing them all from all over. We was bringing them from all over. We was bringing them from all over then. And we was just having a good time. That's part one. That's the history of Chicago before I started hosting. I don't want to take too much time. I'm going to do some more. I'm going to be vlogging a lot, y'all. So, like I tell you, I tell everybody, uh, that was part one. That was part one. That was part one of my history in Chicago. I'm going to do a part two of history in Chicago. Then I'm going to do a part three of Memphis. So, y'all, uh, I don't want to go over 10 minutes. I never want to be on too long. But uh, tell your friends to subscribe. Big Keith, your favorite MC page. Tell them to subscribe, 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 subscribe. Um, my first show that I will be doing is that I'll be vlogging. will be tomorrow at Mobile. I'll be going to Miss Marlene's show. This will be my first show I'm doing. So everybody have a good time. I'll come back later and log with you a little later.